guys, welcome, welcome back to my channel. I'm Nine Nicole for the ones who don't know me, and I'm back with another video. Finally, y'all, like, I've been missing for like what, a month? But okay, wait, y'all, I've been missing for a month. Y'all haven't seen this face for a month. My baby girl, no, I did not get Corona. I mean, I think I might have it now, which is kind of why I'm filming this video because I have two weeks off to quarantine. Um, so I'm actually slow down. You know what I'm saying? I need to get some content out. And the reason why I haven't uploaded, if y'all are wondering, I mean, if y'all don't care, then I'll put the timestamp of where the actual video starts so y'all can just skip to that part. But basically, I've been having technical difficulties. So, like, when I was able to film and edit and actually get the video saved, I couldn't upload it on YouTube. And when I couldn't do none of that. I couldn't film because my phone kept saying I didn't have storage, even though I kept buying storage, and it said that I obviously had space, but apparently I couldn't record. And then when I was able to record and get enough space, I couldn't save the video because I apparently didn't have enough storage to do that either. So it was just a whole bunch of technical, technical difficulties. On top of all that, I had finals, and I was trying to get my grades up because I had, like, got behind and stuff on top of that. I was working so freaking much, like... I only had two off days, and on those off days, I was focused on my school, and I was also trying to spend time with my family and my boyfriend, because I work, and any other time I can, so those are my two days to do all of that within 48 hours, so. That's made me, be that's made me believe it, believe you want to see me. Y'all ain't here for the title, y'all ain't here for me to be talking about why I haven't been able to upload, so basically... I'm going to be feeling like a get ready me to do nothing or to take Instagram pictures because I got an outfit that I want to wear to take pictures because I haven't took Instagram pictures in almost two months, I think. Since I'm quarantining, I got two weeks to freaking do everything that I really want to do, spend time for myself. So, I'm going to be getting ready and taking pictures. So, y'all going to be coming along with me, you know what I'm saying? Um, so, basically, I'm going to show you guys my outfit, but I need to brush my teeth, wash my face. I'm going to attempt to do like a full face of makeup because I just haven't did like makeup in so long. So basically y'all, uh, y'all can barely see, I don't know why I look like that. But basically I have this jumpsuit that I'm going to be wearing, so it's like all black jumpsuit, right? All black. And I'm going to be wearing it with this jean jacket. Y'all got this jean jacket from Five Below for $5 and it's bomb, like, let's see how I love this jean jacket. But basically... It's going to be like that. And then for Christmas, my baby got me the Retro Fours, you know, the Firebase, you know what I'm saying? So I'm going with that. Y'all, so I originally, I made an outfit to go with these, but I don't like how it looks. Like, I've sewed bandanas all over this stuff, but I really just don't like how it looks or whatever. So this outfit looks really cute, but to make it come together, I'm going to wear it with these white long socks. At the bottom, so it's gonna be like y'all see how dirty these are. That's how you know I'll be wearing them. But basically, it's gonna be like scrunched up. Y'all know the vibes. Y'all know the vibes. It's gonna be scrunched up like that. Basically, it's gonna look real cute. And I'm not sure what parts I'm gonna wear with. I was thinking this, but like it don't really go. But at the same time, it's cute. But then I was thinking this because it's more black and gold, and like it just looks better. It's a fanny pack, but I be wearing it as well sometimes. So. We just gonna see. I'm not really sure which one I'm feeling. And I know these look silver, kind of. They look silver to me, which is why I wanted to wear something silver with it. But I don't have a silver purse that matches this. But then I look close, and it's more like a bronze type of color. Like, can you guys see that? I don't know if you guys could see. But it's like more like a bronze type of color. So the gold goes. And I think I'm gonna wear it with my. No, let me show you guys. Yeah, I'm holding this tripod over here. It's hard. But I'm going to wear it with my watch. I'm going to wear it with my watch. Y'all, yeah, it's not an Apple Watch, but it's just, I use this for work. Just so you can text me and stuff. Because people be texting me too much. But I'm going to wear it with my watch. And like my gold necklace. Like one gold necklace, maybe. My gold bangle. And then my silver bangles. Because you can wear silver bangles and gold bangles with anything. So yeah, this is basically the fits you know what i'm saying so yeah i'm just gonna brush my teeth okay so oh y'all know that girl i got this mess on like i said i'm quarantining so i don't want to run into my family by freaking brushing my teeth in my restroom like coming in my restroom 
So, yeah. I'm gonna wash my face, but I'm gonna use my night eczema. So I'm gonna brush my teeth um, to like sit on my face a little bit because I'm breaking out. I don't know if you guys can see, but I'm like really breaking out. So. If you guys hear my thing like that, I'm like they can't be quiet, but you know what? We're not gonna fake it around here, baby. It'd be loud over here every day, so oh well. I'm trying to get them to be quiet a little bit, because you know I gotta post quality content or some my quality content. But you know, sometimes you gotta do what you gotta do. So that's what I'm gonna do. <laughs> Like, I know it'll be cute with the style that I'm going for, but don't want to do that. No, don't feel like doing band two knots, so we can't figure it out. Yeah, so I want to do some band two knots, I feel like that'll be cute and something different, you know. But I don't know if they'll come all right, and I don't know if I really know how to do them, but I feel like with the look that I'm going for, like how it looks together, it'll be real, real cute. So, yeah guys, anyways, let me show you guys why I think I have COVID. So basically, um, my boyfriend, he started feeling bad, but, okay, so, he was gonna get mad at me because I'm saying this, but I don't care, like, he's mine, he ain't going nowhere, you know what I'm saying? But basically, my boyfriend has diabetes, okay, right? Boom, got that out the way. So, this whole time, you know, COVID, I'm like, okay, we, I gotta make sure he's good, like, I gotta make sure I'm on my stuff because... I cannot be giving nothing back to him because, like I said, he has diabetes. Which means he could easily die before anybody, like, any healthy person would, like, you know, per se. Because I rarely get sick, like, I do not get sick. I probably get sick once a year, if that. And it's usually more like a cold. It's not, like, sick sick. You know what I'm saying? So, I was making sure I was on top of my game. And, you know, 2020 about to be over with. So, that was going to be my... That was going to be my biggest flex walking into 2021 saying, like, yo, I have COVID. My man's was good. Like, period. You know what I'm saying? Because, yeah, that was just like, I just felt like that was going to be my biggest flex for the year 2021. You know what I'm saying? Not getting COVID. But, Christmas, okay, so before Christmas, like I said, he has diabetes. So, like, a lot of things going on. Like, he loses, like, his eyesight. He can lose a foot, like, stuff like that. And he wasn't taking real good care of himself, like, previously. So, that was, like, that's the thing that will cause him to lose his eyesight. So, he was always like, oh, my eyes hurt, my head hurt, you know. But that was nothing new, like. I knew that that could have been his diabetes making his eyes hurt, you know what I'm saying? And he always gets headaches, like, when he's, like, when his sugar's, like, perfect or something. So, I wasn't really tripping because he's always getting headaches, like, you know, depending on how his sugar is. So, I wasn't, like, thinking, like, oh, that's COVID, you know what I'm saying? You know? But, okay, so, Christmas Day, he was with me. So, the morning time he was with his family, and he was supposed to be leaving later that night to go get watch Christmas lights with his mom. But they were like, yo, it's Christmas, like, ain't nobody doing no light shows, you know what I'm saying? So, he stayed with me and my family, and we went to go visit my grandma, like, I went to all my people's house, basically, like my grandma. But it wasn't, like, nothing big. Like, it was, like, close family there. Like, um, 
like my uncles, my aunts, their kids, maybe. Like, it was no more than like 15 people in my house, I believe. No, there's seven of us, so that was only like seven and more people. So, and we had our masks on the whole time for one because, like I said, I'm not risking nothing. My boyfriend's a diabetic. Like, why would I? I'm not gonna put him in that type of predicament, you know? So, I made sure we had our masks on, made sure he was washing his hands because we ain't, nah, I ain't playing like that. I ain't coming like that, you know what I'm saying? So, um, that night, um, no, Christmas was like two days after he was saying that stuff about his head or whatever and his eye. So, Christmas Day, he ended up staying all night because we didn't really get home until late. Like, it was probably like 10 um, when we got home. And I didn't want him driving because he started complaining about his eyes and his head again. So, I'm like, nah, you know what? Just stay all night. You can sleep on the floor. You know what I'm saying? Because, like, he really could not see. Like, that boy, I'm pretty sure, ran into my door. Pretty sure I heard him run, run into my door. Like, that's how bad his eyes were. And I didn't want him driving late at night when his eyes was messing up like that. You know what I'm saying? So, I told my mom, I was like, yo, can he stay all night because... He just ain't doing it right now. Like, you know what I'm saying? So, he did. And he left early that morning because he had to go to work at 8. So, I think he woke up at like 6.30 to leave and make it back at home by 7 to take a shower and get ready for work, you know? So, I go back to sleep because I woke up at 6. I didn't have work. I didn't have to be up that early. And I was going to sleep in because I didn't get sleep uh, the previous night. Uh, Christmas Eve, basically. So, I was sleeping in. Um, then, when I wake up, I get a text. And he's like, babe. So I'm like, yo, like, what's going on? Like, hey, good morning. You know what I'm saying? Then that's when he was like, I can't taste nothing. I was like, you can't do what? What are you talking about? You can't taste nothing. You were just in my house and you was around my grandparents. No. That's, no, that's not how you rolling. So, um, he was like, I'm going to get tested. Woo -dee -woo -dee -woo. I can't taste nothing. I'm sorry. I'm like, nah, baby. Don't even. Because you was like, that was my whole thing. You was around my grandparents. First of all, you have diabetes. My grandpa has illnesses. My grandma is old. She's about to be 90 in a week. Like, no. Um, so I was mad. Like, I was really getting mad. Because I'm like, there was ways you could have avoided this. I was always telling you, put your mask back on. Wash your hands before you eat. All of that. And here it is. You can't taste nothing? What are you talking about? You can't taste nothing. And then you were just around me and my family. Mm -mm. So... He wants to get tested or whatever. He still can't taste nothing. I've been trying TikTok remedies all day to try to get him to get his taste back, and he can't taste nothing. But it's like I was just around you, like I was kissing you, like you slept in my room, like I'm gonna have it before my family probably gets it. You know what I'm saying? Because you wore your mask around them. So what are you talking about? So, um, yeah, he wants to get tested, and he got tested. He should be getting his results back today. So today is the 28th, I believe. It's Monday, the 28th, I think. It's the 27th. It's one of those days. So he gets his results back today. And then I'll be getting mine back um, Wednesday. Wednesday, Tuesday or Wednesday. So tomorrow or Wednesday. Um, so yeah. The only thing, like, I'm not really feeling anything. Like, I thought I couldn't taste my orange juice, but I think I'm just tripping. Like, but the only, like, symptoms I've been having is, like, my throat will be hurting, like, every now and then. Like, it's, like, off and on, kind of. And then, like, I'll get, like, random headaches. And, like, I don't know if you can hear it, but, like, my nose is, like, congested. Like, it's, like, real stuffy. So, that's pretty much it. I'm not sure if those are, like, symptoms, symptoms, but it's better to be safe than sorry. Because, like I said, I'm more on the healthy side. So, like, I don't think that I would be having symptoms. Because, you know, some people be having symptoms and don't really. Or, like, some people be having COVID, but they don't know it because they don't have symptoms. So, yeah. But I just did it to be on the safe side, especially because he said that he can't taste or smell nothing. And I was talking to my doctor because she was like, okay, why do you think you're at risk, Goddard? And I was telling her his symptoms and everything, which is why I want to get tested because I was around him and stuff. And she was like, yeah, he had to have it for three to five days before even getting on something. So I'm like, okay, he's already had it for pretty much a week. Like, so I wasn't really tripping because if he do have it, he's had it for like a week, um, according to her. So I'm not going to argue with my doctor. She obviously... I'm guessing knows what she's talking about. But that kind of relieved me because me and, like, we were both scared that he was going to die because, you know, people with, like, health conditions are, like, the main ones dying. And considering he's pretty much had it for a week, um, and he he's just acting the same. Like, he's happy. He's just mad because he can't taste his food. But, like, he isn't, like, down or anything. Like, he's actually, like, really, really happy. So hopefully it's not COVID, and if it is, then to figure out what it is. But if it is COVID, then that's kind of like a relief because he isn't doing bad. Like his sugar's been good. Um, he's feeling 
period. Like, the only thing she's afraid about is me getting it and then me giving it to my family. Like, that's the only thing she really told me. End of him dying, so. Yeah, I don't know how I'm feeling my eyebrows. Like, they look weird because I did them with something different. But we're going to see. This eyebrow looks kind of decent, so. We're going to see how this goes. Um, I'm always scared, but. Yeah, I like to mix my stuff with like a little dark and a little light. So I'm just gonna, I kind of put that one a little too close, a little too close. You know what I'm saying? Um, but yeah, that's pretty much why I think I got COVID, and I'm quarantining. My doctor told me since I was exposed, guys. If y'all didn't know this, just because you test negative, don't mean like within like two days of finding out you were exposed or something. Don't mean that you weren't having. Like she was telling me, like if you were exposed, that's when you need to do those 14 days because. You can get symptoms between day 2 and 14. So, she still needs to quarantine or whatever. So, that's what I'm doing. I've been in my room for not even a full day. I've been in my room all night, starting from like 9, maybe, with nothing to do. And I'm literally dying. So, I don't know how many of these 14 days. Like, I watched the same movie four times last night, and I wasn't even really watching it. Like, for real, for real. So, you don't see. Y'all don't know if I like my eyebrows, so you probably don't have to be do these because yeah, I just don't know if I like them or not. Hmm. So yeah. I'm just gonna blend in some more of it to see how I'm feeling about this. Cause, you know, I don't know. I mean like it's cute. And it's like I don't know, it looks cute on the camera, but like in person. I don't know, maybe it's because of my light or something, but I don't know, but we're going to have to fix this one because this eyebrow low-key looks a little different on the arc. Yeah, this ain't something I need, so we're going to redo it and come back. We're going to scratch this. Just scratch. Yeah, so I low-key forgot I was filming. My eyebrows don't really look that good right now, but we all see. So I just kind of did like a light layer foundation. With a little bit of concealer, so we're gonna see how that Hey my loves, so I'm editing this video, it's like 4 in the morning, and this video is going to be like all over the place just because like, it was just so much stuff going on, and I lost some clips of freaking footage, and like, I don't understand why my phone keeps doing this, like, it just keeps messing up, but basically I lost footage, so between that time and the video you're seeing now, like the clip after this, I just finished my makeup pretty much. And I parted my hair for my buns. I sectioned off my hair for my buns. And yeah. So basically I'm doing my buns buns for now. Um so yeah. <laughs> after that clip you guys just seen so and i want to insert pictures so you guys could see but my face didn't make cuts so yeah hope you guys are having a good morning afternoon evening or night don't forget to give this video a big thumbs up comment down below more videos i would like to see from more and go ahead and subscribe and hit the bell because you might as well bye guys